It is work day one for Katie and Chris, and the deconstruction and then reconstruction of their dated kitchen is about to begin. Don't worry, I'll be extra careful. But right now, we can go ahead and start demolishing this wall. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Clive! That's the way we get it. Right now, we're punching holes inside the wall, then we're gonna peel back the drywall so that we can see what we're dealing with inside yeah. of the wall. Okay, step back, please. Yes. That's Clive demo. Oh, okay. Is what's happening. When Clive explores, it becomes demolition. Well done, Clive. You didn't punch all the way through. You gently tapped gently. around the around the uh, stud there. Very nice stud. Thank you. Thank you, right. Scott. It's amazing what you can do with a little money in a facelift. We're talking about the kitchen still, aren't we? Yes. Oh, very good. This kitchen is going to be transformed when we're finished. It's going to feel like a gutted, brand new kitchen. Excellent. Cheers, love. Look yes. This. Yes. This one you need. Oh, easy. That's why we always <laughs> have to be careful. <laughs> Safety first, class. Did you get that? Yes. <laughs> I just knackered myself. Now, I happen to know that you're not just good at design, correct? You know what I'm talking about. What? Your dance career as a young child. Tap dancing. It, you never forget it, do you? <laughs> now, we have a well-earned break today. And as you know, Jem is an organic baker. I do know that. So these are some of her organic cookies. And that means, I think, that when she baked them, she then did not squirt them with pesticides. That's good to know. Yes. Clivey, while we were putting bamboo in this townhouse, I saw you looking in other people's windows in the neighborhood. Yes. And I'm a little worried. Yes. Well, I did do that, actually. I also looked in the windows of some of the homes that were for sale. And I was so confident about what you all do, I laughed at them. Ha, 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 ha. I like that. Cheers. Don't ever make coffee for me again. <laughs> and later on Design to Sell, doesn't quite work from behind. <laughs> wow, this is gonna be this is gonna be quite a job. <laughs> That's how we work on television. We're actually in it. We're behind it. <laughs> Okay, off we go. It's the start of our very first workday at the Klasky home. The Design to Sell team is ready to go, and there is a lot to do. So let's get cracking. Come along, dear. Very good. Come along. La Porta. Thank you, Clive. Yeah. Help! She's stuck. She won't fit. I just want to make sure my new diet is working. Thank you. I have a couple drawers in my house that need to be put in. You want to go do that? Me. Can you say Clive? I've been thinking a lot about what really matters, and I think it's looking good, first impressions, and vanity. Well, you do look very good, if I may say. First impressions, people always like you. But vanity, I'd be very careful if I were you. Except I'm talking about the two bathrooms that we're making over, Clivey. Oh, I'm sorry. Sometimes you just confuse me. Other times I just tune out. Here comes a towel. Next, if you spill anything, I know this really small woman who come and clean it up. Next, very good. Whoa! That's better, isn't it? Isn't tidying up the bathroom fun? That was crazy. <laughs> good job, gentlemen. Shake hands. Thank you. Kind of an improvement. So this is the deal, Clivey. Yes. We need to come up with a new arrangement for this furniture. Hold on. The key is not dragging furniture across the wood floors. Right. Do you want to go in? I'll go. Oh. I think we're off to a great start. I just need to come up with more furniture for this room. All right. Good. So we're nearly there. We're nearly there. Clean up. All together. Always stay clean and fresh when designing a home to sell. Rub pasta. Pasta. <laughs> Who's got the cleanest hands? High five. Bang. Ow. Bang. Are you all right? You're good. You're good. Just keep rolling on that action. <laughs> Don't miss that. Get in there. Get the camera in there. I'm a demanding director. Get to work. Through the drain. All right, <laughs> 
OK, off we go. The start of work day one for Julie and Alan. And there is lots to do to get this house in tip-top shape for selling. So it's all hands and paws on deck. Oh. If you open your mouth, I'll give you a treat. OK. <laughs> so not you. My portrait is available for purchase. <laughs> I'll give you five dollars. <laughs> all right, done. I love that you didn't give Clive a mouth. He does say enough already. I think I want to buy this one. Julie yes. has just offered to give us a facial. Is that, if, is there time? And will it be done in time for the open house? I think we have enough time before the open house and today, preferably. Great, so I will sign you up for a four o'clock appointment. This is gonna make you gorgeous. At least there's no stranger to grout. I was thinking how easily tile would stick to your face. Do you think this adds value? To your face? Oh, to the house. Do you yeah. think this is a wise use of time with our valuable construction hours and daylight? No. So tell me, how are we doing and are we on track? Actually, we're doing really well. I'm excited. We have a lot more work to do. We have a lot of vinyl tile to stick down. Lisa has painting homework. We have to install the carpeting. We have a lot. Quite a long list. Yes, now drink that prune juice. I've had two glasses. Better hurry then. So we've tried to make the home less eclectic, and we've tried to use natural tones and accessories to raise the bottom line and increase the value. What do you think about that? Uh. Interesting. I'm feeling nervous. You're on the ground. You have no reason to feel nervous. <laughs> well, I'm nervous because it's taking so long, and I want you to start from... No, I'm just kidding. Uh. Oh, never mind. Yeah. Funny old door frame. We can always buy another one. OK, here we go, the start of our very first work day at the Marfis residence. We have everything we need. A lovely rake, shovel, homeowners, carpenters, even a small designer. Hello. Hi, Clivey. Are you ready? I am ready. Well, How about you? Always ready. What do you have planned? We have plants to plant. We have planter boxes to build. We have cornice boxes to build. We have lots going on. Are you going to help today? Always. All right, I love that. Thank you. That's Come along. You. I'm good at shoveling. I'll use this. Oh, yes, you are good at shoveling. I must just tell you that Joe and Denise seemed a bit concerned about the front garden. Something about two old stumps sticking up like rotting teeth in the front garden. <laughs> Half-dead banana plant. Plants moved all over the place. Well, there is a reason that things aren't looking finished. What is that? We're not finished. Huh? Clever. This is like that circus from France. Yes, only it's not entertaining and people wouldn't pay to see it. OK. Here we go. Can we make this former kiddie haven more appealing to a much older and preferably pre-approved crowd? Good morning, class. Good, Good morning, morning, Lisa. I like this. OK, today we have a lot of work to do, kids. Deus and Aaron, you're going to be working on the front door. Got Good it? Morning. Yes, I have it. Greg, you're going to be taking out the old closet doors in the hall and putting in the new ones. Why am I all alone? Clivey, you're going to behave today. And no passing notes while teacher's talking. What am I doing? Behaving. Wow, good luck with that. <laughs> Kehlani, you're painting. OK. I will supervise everybody up. Let's get to work and take out your desks with you. And you want to change your mind about anything else before the open house? Or you think you're probably set on the right track? I've decided that I don't like your shirt after all. Oh, this is paint retaliation. Mm, it's going to be tears before bedtime. Come on. What do we have here? Tell me, talk me through this. Chocolate chip and oatmeal raisin. Shall I go first? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Carry on. Wonderful. Nice. The curbside makeover continues, and it's time for everyone to pitch in. I think the main plant, if it's here, it'll it'll be eye-catching. All right, well let's uh, let's take a look at what we're going to do over there. Excuse me. Okay. Excuse me. Let's take a look over here. Clivey, we had a lot of problems today. Never mind. Everything will be all right in the end, resulting in a top dollar sale. Why? Thank you. Over. Okay, little buddy. Over and out. No, come over. All right. Now. I think they 
work. Thank you. Just because you've spent so much money on these doesn't mean we have to use them all the time. So what we have to do is to make sure everything's as smooth as possible and then we're good to go. Do you agree? You've been sleeping all day. I need all the help I can get. we got a lot of work to do here. The open house is coming quickly. Hopefully. Was Lisa Laporte here? She was here. She was here. She could almost be here now and you wouldn't Man, see her. I missed her. Yes, yeah, she was flitting here up and down. It's like a Yorkie coming and going. But uh, she's a clever little thing. People like her. You know, Lisa, beating the Brockman's kitchen to a pulp with a sledgehammer inspires me to go home and do that to my own kitchen. Don't do that. No. No. All right. Because you're not selling. Yes. Go. Beat it. I'm coming in for the second team. When you're ready to step out, say, I'm ready to step out. Hey! Here we go. This has been absolutely fascinating. There is so much that we don't know about what we should be doing for the planet. And uh, I just hope we can do it individually enough because you feel helpless. It's a serious issue, Clivey. And unfortunately, the building industry is one of the biggest culprits. Empty, hollow. Clivey, don't feel bad. We're doing something. No, the dumpster, it's empty. Clivey, that's a good thing. Honestly, nobody can recycle trash like you. <laughs> well, you and your jokes are legendary. <laughs> oh, thank you. Also recycled. How you doing out there? It's 100 degrees in the shade. Then how hot is it right here? Now that you're out there, about 120. <laughs> I like this. I should always be carried around like this. <laughs> I think this door is a little tight here. I don't think that helps me turn this. Wait, one moment. Hello. <laughs> no one can make putting up a closet door this much fun. Seemingly, we haven't put it up yet. <laughs> yes, not yet. Did you hold that? It's annoying me. Yes. We are done. Simple fix. Easy to, well, sort of easy to do it for us. But it's done, and it looks great. Voila. We're going to play um, golf. Yes. So I hope you're ready for that. I'm very ready because Zach gave me a lesson in my swing. Wonderful. And I see you have your rather oddly shaped golf club here. That would be called a driver. Lovely. So very briefly, if you don't mind, how's the makeover going? Good. That was brief. All right, off we go. Here we go. Ah! I hope we find that hole that you were looking for. So, having painted the room 17 times, do you feel that we've come close to a decision? I think I am definitely going to paint the room one of the last two colors. The world breathes a collective sigh of relief. Cheers. You English nut. Thank you. Not in front of the baby. I have a feeling that the milks may win the award for the all-time need for depersonalization. Yes! Yes! If you really want to sell, I have a better idea for the right kind of photographs that will get you top dollar. <gasps> oh. These add value. Yeah. I've got a better one. OK. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. <laughs> that would be a lovely Halloween gift for someone. Target, and are we on time? The living room's painted, and the bathroom cabinet's underway. We refinished the chandelier. Yes. And we have a lot more work to do, and Chloe's a little concerned. I know, because coming up, Chloe's area, Chloe's area has oh. to go away. That's going to be a problem at Open House. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. What could be nicer relaxing at this home than a, a milkshake? How appropriate. <laughs> at the milks. Oh, yes. So how are we doing? How was today? We had a great day. We painted in the living room. We depersonalized. And the garage is well underway. Most of all, I got rid of those awful hives. Oh, that'll be the ointment. Glad it worked out for you. And this is great. She's a great artist. She's offered to paint a portrait of me. Really? Has she said that? No, no. So I think she said it with her eyes, and I'm going to ask her. Oh. It's really a work of art, this makeover. It's not a project. I'm sorry. You're doing wonderfully well. I want to congratulate you. Try this. It's delicious. 
got it from the pool. Hi, babe. What? I want to talk to you about something. Where is this going? I overheard the homeowners oh. talking about the fact and that they're aware of the fact that you don't really do anything around here. Having seen the show, um, you get the impression that Clive works really hard. Uh, not so much. Not so much, really. Let me tell you, I overheard our homeowners discussing a rather bold design choice that you made. If I said the expression, she's painted a wall black, would that ring a bell? Cheers. Touché. Touché, indeed. So let's get an update. How are we doing? Because there's a whole mishmash merging of styles. The old meets the new. Previous looks becoming updated with new ones. We are making things fresh, new, clean, contemporary, modern. Even. And much like yourself, Thank you. I would have to say. Very good, La Pointe. How's it going and how happy are you? I'm happy. I think we've made amazing progress. We've started a lot of jobs. We haven't finished many jobs. None, really. But we haven't run into any major obstacles, so I'm pleased. So you're happy? I'm happy. It's that amazing mix of emotions and confidence with design tips that steers our homeowners on the road to value at the open house. A bit much? It's a little much. Yeah, something like that, though. But you're on the right track. Yeah. What's happened to your home today, and what's it like? We have a lot of holes in the wall. But none of the walls are actually down yet. Do you trust everything Lisa says and does? Absolutely. I trust her completely. <laughs> Good news, it's always okay in the end. And how much richer will you be? A lot. A lot. <laughs> <laughs> end of work day two. Let's truly talk about sacrifice when it comes to doing anything at all to sell your home. Look, mm. you're leaving. We are. Tell me what's happening. Well, I guess we have to be out of the house when they do the floors, stay in them, so, uh, you know, it's a chance to go away. Tell me your favorite parts of what is happening to your house and just how you're doing in general. I'm excited about the floor. I like the floor. You like it? I think it's gonna look great. To have the expert eyes show us what we need has been very helpful. Feeling good? Yes. Ready to be richer. Nice work, honey. Beautiful! All right. You've got an interesting past ahead of you. Or wait. Interesting. How does that work? <laughs> That's like, what is that deja vu of the future? Yeah, right. This is fun. Oh my gosh. Now, Lisa, would I be right in describing today as a feeling that we're all floored? <laughs> yes, by the Clyde. floor. Yes, Clivey, we're floored all right because this is quite a project we have going on here. The patching, the sanding, it's been a big day. It's gonna add huge value and oh. sell the house on the right day. You know it, Clivey. But we also got started in the kitchen, which is good because yes. we have our work in there too. Yes. But we should be right on cue for work day two. That rhymes. Very I good. did. She's a poet and I didn't know it. Now, I cannot wait for your report because I know there's a lot of good going on and you're very happy. I am thrilled that we managed to put down almost 250 square feet of slate in this house. Paving the way to profit, someone uh, had to say that. But I'm a little concerned that Dale is concerned about mm -hmm. my accent paint color. You know what though? I want him to be happy. Yes, I think he wants to make top dollar. I told him to pick up the pieces and move on. So in summary, yes. great floor. Yes. Well done, everything's great, he's fine, and they'll be rich. I like that. Thank you. I'll take it. Wonderful. This is the problem with dusting in a home, you know? You do all the chandeliers, all the surfaces, you dust. Four years later, you have to start all over again. Well, this is very interesting. I like it. It's a bold statement. For what, Clive? sitting on their furniture in the front garden. <laughs> Works for me. You like this? I do, I'm gonna go home and do it. It's very nice. Having a sofa on the front lawn is not good for resale. No, actually, no, good point. But what is good for resale is everything you've done inside. Isn't it looking great? And the homeowners are gonna be rich. Mm, and he says, yeah, it's <laughs> nice. Good. And it's just a really warm, happy room, isn't yes, it? Yes, it is. Very warm. Something else is feeling strangely warm. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't think we'll talk about yeah, that. No, exactly. I think we're fine. Okay, I think we're good, fine. Good. Now, are you... I'm picking up a vibe. <laughs> what is that vibe, I hear you ask? It is that you're pleased. Really? Yes, you're pleased. That vibe, you're doing I? this. Look, yes, there. 
It's the swinging of the feet. Right. I am pleased. I'm very happy with what we've accomplished. Yes. And I am so excited about the changes. It's absolutely a sure thing when you spend money in the kitchen. So it's an easy run to the open house. Absolutely. A quick profit. And everyone's laughing all the way to the bank like this. <laughs> well, maybe not like that. No, perhaps not. If you were walking in to buy this house, what would you be thinking and what would you like? Well, the space. A lot of... Got a lot of know, space. space. Oh, excuse me a moment. Yes. So, so the space? Yeah. What a wonderful, productive day, I'm assuming. Well, yes, it's almost nighttime now. Yes, good night. We've had a long, productive day. Yes, yes. What do you look back on and are most pleased about? Oh, the bathroom floor. Yes. It's gorgeous. The blinds came down. Uh, yeah, we did a lot of superficial work in the living room. And, are you uh, calling my work superficial? Well, we both know you can be superficial sometimes. I suppose you're right. But your work was important. To some extent, I helped. Still, we've done well. We've done well. And work day two bodes well. Yes, Aww. and this place is going to look great. This family room, but in order to do that, we need to compact the furniture in so that we don't get any paint on it while we paint the walls. Right. Isn't the furniture already compacted in the <laughs> middle of the room? We need to compact it even more. <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, I had a new use for these suitcases. Yes? You can fill them with money off <gasps> the open house. That would be great. Our non-stick oh. rug mat stuck to the floor. Oh, no. You're pulling the plug on my one true love. Oh, Let my go. God. Come on, be strong. Uh, what's been going on that you're very pleased about? You have a pep in your step. <laughs> I do? I hadn't realized. No, you do. Tell me. Uh, I'm very pleased with what's happening inside. I am in love with the marble oh. that we splurged on for yes. the shower. It's looking good. I mean, it's gone from grungy bathroom that didn't please Donna to a real showpiece. It's, it is going to be a showpiece. How are you guys doing? Because I see your home is now outside. It is. In the courtyard. Mm -hmm. So how, who's, who's feeling good about this? Well, I know we're going to get cash from all this chaos, so we're definitely in there. For I like that attitude. So, in other words, you're doing all right. Yep. You don't mind what it takes. No. You're thinking about the money. I think you two should have a cuddle. Mm. Lady Lisa. Hey, Clivey. Packing up. You know, there's no better feeling than the end of a hard day's work. And how would you know that? Oh, yes, you're right, actually. Well, I do feel good, and I guess you feel good as well. <laughs> yes, and we have had a good hard oh, work no, day. I know. What are you pleased about today? Oh, the patio is looking great. That's going to be gorgeous. I like that the dining room is now going to be where the office was. Yeah. I'm really pleased. Well, here, let me help you. All right, bye. Don't strain yourself. It was difficult when the wall came down, and you are surely realizing that. Yeah, the house will be exactly the way I wanted it to be, and I have to leave. This is going to be so nice. Somebody's going to buy it right away. It's the realization that it's time to say goodbye. Is that, do you think that's correct? I don't want to say goodbye to my house. <laughs> I think somebody needs a cuddle. Yeah. <laughs> Never thought for $2,000 you could turn this house around, but by Jove, you've done it again. This morning, that kitchen was unfinished, it was a blank slate, and now it's a gorgeous kitchen. Tons of value. The living room's looking pretty nice, too. Apart from the fact it looks twice the size. It does look twice the size, and it looks twice as valuable. Well, I would say the moral of the story is never doubt the designer. She can work miracles, and she's always right. Something like that? Exactly. Rounding up. Well, thanks for coming by. Nice to see you. To go to many open houses. Mm. Yeah, me too. Now, predictions, because everything you've touched is a mess, but turning to real estate gold. <laughs> so mm. what's going to happen? Meditate on this. It's a mess right now, but in comes the money the minute open house happens. <laughs> Ten seconds. Shut up. Ten seconds. <laughs> quiet, quiet, quiet. Shh, shh, shh. Oh, this. <laughs> <laughs> We're not very good at this, are we? No, we are not. There's nothing like taking a moment out during the day from hard toil and labor. I agree. And gloating. Is that what we're going to do yes, now? Yes, this is, is the, the gloating, gloat? the gloating section. What are you pleased about? Because you've done pretty well. You've 
wrecked their home, really, but what are you pleased about? <laughs> I'm pleased that we've made a big mess in the living room. Yes. And I'm pleased that we made a big mess in the courtyard. Yes. I'm also pleased that we've made a big mess with the front doors. Yes. Because big messes turn into big changes, which turn into big dollars. And the homeowners are sort of pleased. Stress them out, wreck their home, and then make them rich at the end. Is that your plan? They can be stressed out all the way to the bank. Now let's get Lisa's spin on the day's progress. What is the update? I'm sure there's a lot that's been done. Well, you tell me. We got a lot of work done outside. Lots of digging, lots yes. of demo. More like digging demo. That irrigation system took a bit of a hit. That was a surprise water line, but we will work our way through it. We'll Correct. remove the water line. Good answer. And on our next work day, we have a lot of work to do inside. Yes. And a lot of planning to do outside. I caught some big problems here. We have two big rooms that I need to furnish, and I have budget to think about. I have to select furniture, and I have to get it all here by open house. And as no one is listening, do you have much money left in the budget? You are known as Elastic Lisa in certain circles because you can stretch it further than anybody else. Sure can. You make that budget go round. Lisa? Yes, Clive? I know this for a fact. The list of things that you are pleased about is long. Well, look at this room. It's brighter. The whole room is reflecting light because we got rid of the red wall and we got rid of that dark paneling and had a drywall. Look at the difference that can make. If you think back to what Dame Shannon said, that it was like a cave. Yes. I don't think any, uh, any cavemen or women would make offers on this property now. Is it making you feel good? Lisa will make these into window treatments. There you go. <laughs> How was that? I say put it in the show. I definitely agree. Alan and Juby up the pressure. We have big news, Clive. We found a place in a great neighborhood, and we're in escrow, mm -hmm. so we really need to sell this place fast. You're in escrow, and I'm in shock. <laughs> <laughs> now, we've had a really productive day. We've had a couple of glitches, but we're not out of the woods yet. No, I like the bar very Good. much. Good. like the paint color. Good. Little bit of trouble having them let go of their big screen TV. We had some furniture problems, but we worked through them and I think we'll be just fine. And I'm looking forward to taking offers on the bar. Cheers. Cheers. Lisa. Yes, Clive? Now then, have you ever outdone yourself? Is that a trick question? Yeah, because I think you've really outdone yourself on this project. I think we have outdone ourselves. I am so excited. We have added architectural oh, drama with okay. the beams, yeah, the chandelier. Yeah. The deck was a major nightmare but we've spun it into gold. We spun it into money. See if our designer is beaming about today's progress oh too. Oh, you've done it again. I have. You have. I mean, this is an incredible project. Look at what you have pulled out of your design hat. It's, it's, it's architectural design to sell. You know what? This is a great building. There's another unit in the building for sale. We need to compete. Yes. But it hasn't been easy. The patio, still a problem. And the beams were a little heavy, but we're adding character, we're adding drama, and if we grab the home buyer's emotions, we'll grab their pocketbook. So, we've made it kind of to the end of day one. Right. right. And there's an awful lot going on. Everything's in chaos. I'm just curious, how are you doing? I'm dirty and I'm exhausted and my feet hurt. Mike, how are you doing? I'm doing great. I'm learning all sorts of manly trades and uh, it's <laughs> been an excellent experience. I feel Who's much more old? macho now. Yes. Still worthwhile? Completely. We see the horizon. We know we're going to make a lot more money on this house than we would have ever made. And we're going to move somewhere bigger and better and right. oh. nicer for our oh. family. That's right. Oh. <laughs> well, we're approaching the grand finale for our musical homeowners, Seth and Amy. It's the end of work day two, and on that note, we have to up the tempo because the open house is just five days away. Now, Lisa LaPorta? Yes, Clive Pierce. I know you're very happy and very excited. At the end of work day one, I can feel it. I am. I can see it. I'm thrilled. We cleared out clutter. We sanded the floor after fixing damage. We stained the floor. We filled in the gaps in the wall. We painted a bedroom. This is a good day. And work day two? Yes. Prediction. A lot more work to do. Yes. But when we're finished, this house is going to be transformed in a big dollar way.